Always yeah. great catching up with my next guest, Yadong Song, who will be back in action against Pyotr Jan, UFC 299 on March 9th. Song, how are you, man? How are you? I'm good. Good. Well, it's good to talk to you. Of course, uh, you and I spoke after your last fight, and I know you went back home and you got to enjoy yourself. And then we find out that the fight with Pyotr Jan is rebooked. When did you find out that this fight was official for UFC 299? Um, like about a week uh, after my last fight, oh, I great. heard from my coach Uriah. He's um, he's also my manager, and uh, he said uh, I will be fighting Yan in March. Okay. And uh, after uh, two weeks later, I signed the contract. Yeah. Great. Were you happy to get this fight rebooked? Because um, he's a pretty big name in the division. Of course. Yes, I'm so happy. I've always been very sad and uh, looking forward to this fight. It's a great opportunity to get uh, to uh, can get me to the title. Yeah. And uh, I like to compete with the uh, high level fighters because it will make me improve i agree i agree yeah. um he's gonna have a really big layoff going into this fight he hasn't fought in a while how much will that impact him in the fight do you think uh i think i believe that as a championship level fighter long break won't uh, have any impact on him instead mm -hmm. i think it will lead to an even better performance he made uh, reflected on his skill and improved um them yeah how do you feel like your style matches up against Piotr's in in this fight it's definitely going to be an explosive fight yeah both of us are top uh striker in the bantam way and, and I, I would like to face him stand up i believe uh, my boxing is better than him but you know this is an mma fight everything can happen in the fight Absolutely. Um, training camp. Who have been some of your main training partners helping you get ready for Piotr? Uh, I've been training with a uh, pro boxer, um, and uh, also I practice wrestling with uh, the new, new, new young talent uh, talents who just enjoy our team. Okay. Is this the same uh, wrestler? There, there's a Matt. I spoke to Max Griffin yesterday, um, and Max Griffin told me he was working with some uh, NCAA wrestler. Is this the same guy? Uh, no, no. He's uh, he's he's a way bigger. You know, way, way, way oh, bigger. Oh, right, than right. Me. Yeah. He mentioned he looked like Thor or something. So yeah, yeah. probably not the same guy. I okay. came with uh, small guys. Right. Okay. <laughs> that, that that makes sense. That's great. Yeah. Um, and did you, are you working with specific training partners for Piotr's style or are you just working with like anyone? Yeah. Uh, in our gym, there is, there are no, 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 that no, uh, there's no, Young style, you know. Okay. So yeah. I just train the best boxer and the good wrestler, and the, yeah, like every camp, every camp I train like this. Yeah, I don't, I can't find someone like Peter style. Right. Is <laughs> a is a different. Yeah. Who will be in your corner for this fight? Who will be in the cage with you? Um, Uriah, Uriah, Faber, Danny. Castillo. And, uh, yeah, Castillo uh, and uh, Marquez, my boxing coach, and and uh, uh, Cedric. Cedric is uh, he's he's uh, our new kickboxing coach, uh, who is a uh, uh, um, kickboxing world champion. He's, he's very good. I know I knew him since like eight years ago. Most of his fight uh, were in China. Okay. Yeah, he's cool. A very good. He's a very good coach. A very good fighter. And what is your prediction for this fight? How do you think this fight will play out? Uh, no matter what happened, I will win the fight. <laughs> okay. Great. Um, with the, with it being uh three rounds instead of five, um, does that make it easier or harder for you? Uh, it depends on how you, how you um separate the you know how how you set up the the pace you know right how you uh, who you face face to like you know he's a good fighter is you know this fight definitely definitely gonna be a hard one so yeah but i'm okay with that i i my last three fights were five rounds so 
I'm okay with condition. Yeah. Um, yeah. And let's do some rapid fire questions, some fun questions here at, at the end of the interview. Um, who do you think is the best striker in the UFC besides Song Yudong? <laughs> uh, uh, what's the name? You could prize pay a lot of money. X Pereira. X Pereira. Great answer. Pereira. Okay, great answer. Who who is yeah. the who is the best grappler? Grappler definitely um, Habib Habib Habib. Okay, who is the funniest fighter? Johnny Walker. Okay, who would you want to have dinner with if you could have dinner with any fighter? Uh Connor McGregor. Okay, yeah, gotcha. McGregor. Yeah. Um, who would you want by your side if you were in a street fight? Fancy Igano. Francis Ngannou, great choice. Who, yeah. which fighter has the highest fight IQ? John Jones. Okay. What is the dream fight that you would want to see in the UFC? Nick Diaz versus Nate Diaz. Okay, great answer. I like that. That's really good. That's, that's maybe the best answer I've had on that. that, that that's yeah, really yeah. good. Um, back to your fight. You mentioned it there. Piotr Jan, a former champion. You've been on a nice win streak. Where does a win put you? How close does a win with with Piotr get you to a title shot? Do you think? I think uh, one more or straight to the title fight. I have the I have the if I win him, yeah. Okay, so mm. so very very close. I think because right, we don't really know we don't know who's going to fight the winner of Cheeto and Sean o, uh, Sean O'Malley, right? So um, I suppose there's a possibility you could get a title shot if you win. Yes, sure. Yeah, it will we'll be interested to see that. Um, has the UFC told you at all if there's an injury in the main event that you could step in uh, for for either Cheeto or, or Sean? No, they didn't. They didn't tell me that. Okay, but no. some something we'll be keeping an eye well, on. I sure. think it happened. I think it happened. Yes. Yeah. 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 We'll we'll, we'll see what happens there. Um, and my last question before we go, we referenced it there. You got to go back home to China. How was that getting getting to see everyone, especially after a big win like that in, in your last fight? Uh, actually, I only stay in China for three days. Okay. Uh, with my families. So, uh, before heading back, uh, back, I went to Philippines to train boxing with uh, Pacquiao's coach. Oh, cool! For five days. Yeah. It's, How was that? That was amazing. I I really enjoyed that. Yeah, very good. Very cool. Yeah. Okay. How did that get yeah. set up? Who did you know to go work with him? Like, how did how did you end up working with him? A friend of mine. A friend of mine. Yeah. Okay. That that that's yeah. really cool. Uh, yeah, that's very cool. So, yeah. Good stuff. Song, thanks so much for doing this. I really appreciate the time. If there's anyone you'd like to thank, any sponsors or any social media you want to mention, I will give you the last word. Okay. If you like you, follow my Instagram. Yeah, don't song. Thank you very much.